Hi, I'm back again with Nika for more yoga sequence. Hi. So today we'll be doing a really short, simple morning workout to really just stretch you out and give you the energy you need for the day. Yes, I designed a very simple routine for you guys to just help you wake up, stretch your muscles, to feel energized and also to stimulate your digestion. Right, so let's get started. Let's do it. We'll start with lying down on our back. Just make sure you're comfortable. You can actually do this part even when you're still in bed. Just keep your legs apart, shoulders apart. And we're going to bring awareness to our breath. Relaxing your whole body. Breathing deeply through your nose. And before your mind gets preoccupied with all the things you have to do today, just take that moment to connect with your breath. Maybe set intention for the day. Think how you would like the day to unfold. How you would like to feel today. Breathe deeply. One more deep breath in. And gently exhale out. And then slowly bring your legs together and gently all the way up to your chest. Give it a nice squeeze. Might be rock from side to side. Gently warm up the spine. And slowly release your left leg all the way down the ground. And we're going to bring your right knee all the way over to the left. Extend your right hand to the right side. You can look to the right. Nice, gentle spinal twist. Inhale deeply. And exhale out. With your next inhale, you're going to go back up and change the side. Right leg goes down, left knee squeezing to your chest and then gently all the way over to the right, extending your left hand to the side. Gentle twist. One more time, all the way to the center. Squeeze your both knees to your chest. And then slowly try to sit all the way up. All right. With inhale, let's bring our hands all the way. And as you exhale, slowly fold all the way forward. Allow your hips to open. Breathing deeply. And with inhale, slowly walking your palms back. Let's twist again to the left, right arm on your left knee, left hand behind you. It's really good to start your morning with some gentle twists to wake up your spine and also to stimulate your digestion. Let's repeat on the other side, twist to the right. Breathe deeply, keep your back straight, your spine tall, sitting down. All the way back. To the center. Good. From here, we are going to bring your palms forward and release into our tabletop and then gently into cat, cat, cat and cow stretch. We're going to arch our back, squeeze our glutes. Good. And then slowly release, lifting up. And again, gently arch your back and slowly release. This is really great. Stimulate its spine, open it up, arch, and release. Then one more time, arch, and slowly release. As you inhale, tack in your toes, gently lift all the way up into your down with up, stretching our legs. This is a really great pose. If you only have time to do one yoga pose in the morning, make it a downward dog. It will stretch all your muscles, release some of that stiffness. 
can walk in one place, keeping your tailbone up and your back nice and flat. Gently stretching your hamstrings. Good. And then slowly as you inhale, let's start walking forward to the front of your mat. Good. From here, bend your knees. Keep your left hand down. Right hand is reaching all the way up and you're straightening your right leg as you go up. Again, opening up the whole chest. Looking up. Inhale deeply here. As you exhale, gently go down. Let's repeat on the other side. Left hand reaching up, straightening your left leg, stretching that leg. Looking up towards your palm. Inhale deeply. As you exhale, gently go down. From here, you're gonna bring your palms behind. Interlace your fingers. Slowly lift up and stretch your legs. Stretching your whole back and shoulders. Releasing some of the stiffness. Inhale. As you exhale, lower your hips, lower your palms, and let's gently lift all the way up into your chair pose. All right, chair pose is really great to energize our whole body. All right, stretch the glutes. You surely feel a surge of energy when you hold that. Good. Inhale, let's lift all the way up. As you exhale, palms together, lower again and twist to the right. Wake up your digestive system. Look over your right shoulder, trying to keep your hips low. Deep breath in here and exhale out. One more time, inhale, lift up. And as you exhale, twist to the other side. Keeping your chest nice and open, low hips. Breathe, feel the energy flowing through your body. Inhale, let's lift all the way up again. As you exhale, bring your palms to your chest. From here with inhale, bring your hands all the way up. As you exhale, flow all the way forward. Inhale, lengthen your spine. As you exhale, step back into plank pose. From here, you can drop your knees or go all the way down into your chaturanga. Inhale, roll up into cobra. And exhale into your downward dog. From here with inhale, bring your left leg all the way up. As you exhale, step all the way forward between your palms. Ground your right foot. With next inhale, lift your hands all the way up and settle in your warrior one. And again, feel the energy flowing through your legs. Breathe deeply for another three. Two, relax your shoulders. And one, with inhale, lift up. As you exhale, palms down. Step back to flank and gently into chaturanga inhale cobra as you exhale down with up inhale bring your right leg all the way up as you exhale step all the way forward ground your left inhale let's lift all the way up warrior one if your left knee doesn't feel too great you can always twist your foot into your high line and breathe for three. Keep your right knee right above your ankle. Two. And one. Inhale, lift up. Exhale, slowly down. Step back. Into plank and chaturanga. Inhale, cobra. And exhale into your downward dog. Let's hold your downward dog for a few breaths. Again, lengthening the spine. Energizing your body. Feeling the stiffness in our muscles slowly melting away. Another two. And one. Inhale. As you exhale, step all the way forward. Inhale, lift your head up. Exhale, fold. As you inhale, you can keep your knees slightly bent. Lift all the way up. Exhale, release. Let's move on to the next pose. Inhale up. Exhale down, we're gonna flow through our breath. Inhale, lift. Exhale, step back to plank pose. Gently to trot around. Inhale, cobra. And exhale, down with up. Inhale, left leg goes all the way. Exhale, step all the way forward. Ground your right. Inhale, hands all the way up. As you exhale, settle in your warrior two. Again, building strength in our body and energy through the legs and core. 
breathe shoulders relaxed releasing down another two and one and slowly all the way forward step back into chattering inhale cool and exhale down with down let's repeat on the other side inhale right leg goes up exhale step forward ground the left inhale all the way up as you exhale warrior two good keep the right knee right above your ankle relax your shoulders three three two and one gently palms down to the ground step back to plank inhale exhale chaturanga inhale cobra and exhale down with up rest in your down dog if you feel like too, this is too much you can always rest in your child's pose like this okay then breathe another three lengthening through the spine focusing on your breath two and one. inhale again as you exhale walk or step all the way forward inhale lengthen exhale bend forward inhale all the way up exhale release we'll do a few more rounds with different poses in between inhale up exhale down inhale lengthen exhale step or jump back into chaturanga inhale cool and exhale down with up with inhale bring your left leg all the way up and with exhale slowly fold good bring your right leg all the way up and you can bring the hands all the way up into warrior three if it's harder for you to find balance you can keep the hands on the ground no problem or bring in your chest warrior three make sure you square your hips lift the chest up this one really energizes the whole body breathe another two and when as you exhale slowly release step back into plank inhale exhale chaturanga inhale cobra and exhale down with down let's repeat on the other side right leg goes all the way as you exhale step forward inhale left leg reaching all the way up. keep it down on the ground or if the balance is good palms to your chest or reaching all the way forward make sure you lift your chest up and you square your hips another two good and when exhale palms to the ground step back into plank chaturanga inhale cobra and exhale downward dog and again breathe deeply in your down dog focusing on your breath reconnecting in the breath another three lengthening the spine two and one one more time inhale as you exhale step all the way forward inhale lengthen exhale full inhale all the way up and exhale palms to your chest let's continue flowing inhale as you exhale bend forward inhale lengthen exhale step back into plank pose gently to chaturanga inhale cobra and exhale down with down inhale left leg goes all the way up as you exhale step all the way forward and we're going to point our feet forward here bring your hands in the back interlace your fingers inhale lengthen your spine as you exhale bend all the way forward and stretch your hands breathe deeply here opening up the shoulders and stretching the legs one more deep breath in exhale out good then gently drop your palms on your back and come all the way forward step back to plank chaturanga inhale cobra and exhale down and down let's repeat on the other side right leg goes up 
exhale step forward ground your both feet pointed forward bring your hands in the back interlace your fingers head up with inhale as you exhale gently fall forward again keep breathing deeply here feel that nice stretch in the back of your legs releasing the shoulders one more and then slowly drop your palms down on your hips come to the front of your mat palms down step back to plank and chaturanga inhale cobra and exhale downward facing down and again keep breathing deeply here you feel the surge of energy already oh yeah i am sweating <laughs> Definitely waking up your whole body. Two. And one. Inhale. As you exhale, step all the way forward. Head up and fold. Inhale all the way up. And exhale, release. Inhale, bring your hands up. And exhale, swan it forward. Inhale, lengthen. And exhale, step back to plank. Chaturanga, gentle cobra, and downward dog. With inhale, bring your left leg all the way. As you exhale, step all the way forward. We're going to drop our right knee down and go to a crescent pose. Now you can either bring your palms on your hips and gently just try to sink in forward to open the hip flexors. If you want to go deeper, you can bring your hands all the way up and gently try to tilt to the back. Remember not to push in the pose. You're just slowly sinking into it, going with your breath. Line the hips and chest and heart to open up. Okay. Inhale deeply one more time. As you exhale, bring your palms down. Step back to plank and chaturak. Inhale, cobra. And exhale, down with up. One more time on the other side, right leg goes up. Inhale. As you exhale, step forward, drop your left knee into the crescent, hands all the way up. Or if it's not that great with your lower back, you can just drop it on your hips, open up your chest, draw your shoulders to the back, and just stay here for a moment. Open up. Stretch. Three, two, and one. As you exhale, palms to the ground. Step back into plank and chaturanga. Inhale, cobra. And exhale, downward dog. Hold your down dog. Breathe deeply here for three, two, and one. And as you exhale, slowly drop your knees down, bringing it wide apart, pointing outwards. And we're gonna just simply release into your child's pose, forehead down, again, connecting with your breath, grounding, relaxing your shoulders, slow down the breath. One more deep breath in. Exhale out. And then slowly bring your palms next to your knees. With inhale, lift up. Bring your knees together and to finish it off, we're going to twist gently. Right palm on your left knee, left hand behind. Twist to the left, look over your left shoulder. One more nudge for your digestive system to wake up. And then to the other side, looking over your right shoulder, keeping your spine straight. Good, and then slowly release in the center. And you are done, good morning. Good morning. So this is a really simple and gentle morning stretches which you can do on a daily basis. It's just a great way to bring back awareness to your body and also mind. Yes, exactly. And every time when you have a day when you really don't feel like working out, just trust me, get on the mat and do this simple few stretches and you will actually have the energy to do more than that. 
Yeah, I've been doing a lot of um, Nika's video, especially on days where I don't feel like doing an intense workout. So you can check out more yoga videos right here with Nika and we will be filming a lot more exciting videos together as well. So be sure to like this video, subscribe and follow Nika and you can check out more links in the description box below. Have a beautiful day guys. Have a lovely day guys and we will see you next time. Bye.